Hello and welcome to my first YouTube video. Um, I'd like to use this video to explain a little bit what I have done to my, my Bluetooth uh, system, my B80, uh, in order to, to uh, make it easier for me to clean. I have changed all the ball valves for butterfly valves uh, available from Bluetooth in a 34mm. Uh, so I will take you through the, the various valves and, uh, and how, they, how they work and why they're here. And uh, I hope you enjoy and if you have any questions let me know and I'll try my best to answer them or take some, some pictures showing it from other angles if, if that's necessary. Enjoy! On the left side of the um, Brutals B80 I have uh, the outlet from the, uh, from the kettle which is then uh, connected to a butterfly valve where we can either close off or open up the the outlet and lead it into the pump uh, located underneath here. We can also, when we want to sparge, we can close off this valve, connect the sparge water here, flush the pipe, something which I found is very important, and then we can open up in this direction and then send the sparge water up the, the center pipe and through the, the mash hat uh, to sparge. Once, once we're done with that, we can close off here and open up again and we can recirculate. So on the left side we have the, the pump is connected in here and we have a, a small T in here and on top of that we have a, a butterfly valve as well that will allow us to send the, the ward up the, um, the center pipe. To close that off we will lead the ward down into the side glass and then we can take more or less two directions. We can either send it by opening this one, send it back up into the kettle or <clears throat> we can close that off and then we can open up here and we will send it through the chiller and it will then come out here and up the kettle again. Finally we can send it through the chiller, we can close off the kettle and then we can open up this valve and we can send it to the fermenter via the drain port here. So this port is the lowest point in the system and is all located such that all the, the water or the wort will drain out through this port so I can connect this into my, my bucket with my pump. So that concludes my first video. Um, if you like what you saw, let me know. If you don't, let me know as well what I can improve. I know the microphone is not the best. I will see if I can uh, improve that in the future. I have a video in planning for the um, for the fermenter behind me that is bubbling away on how I clean it using uh, the brew tools as a, a sparge or as, as, a, as an HLT along with the pump and a CIP spray ball. I managed to get it clean uh, every time uh, without too much effort. Uh, so I will try to, to film that and explain what I do in order to make our lives as easy as possible while ensuring that we get the best beer possible. So. Uh, Enjoy brewing and uh, until next time. Cheers. Mm -hmm.